The brain is the headquarters of the central nervous system. More than 10 billion cells transmit messages to and from all parts of the body. The brain controls every thought and most movement. Although it makes up only 2% of your body weight, it consumes 20% of the energy produced. This range of bulges, collectively called the brain stem, forms the central core of the brain. The medulla oblongata is the lowest part of the brain stem and serves as a site of connection between the brain and the spinal cord. It contains a number of nerve centers, which are responsible for controlling involuntary processes such as the heartbeat, breathing, and body temperature regulation. The medulla oblongata is only about an inch wide, but in spite of its small size, it is integral in the transmission of nerve impulses between the spinal cord and the higher brain. At the front of the brain stem, just above the medulla oblongata, is a band of nerve fibers called the pons. The pons is responsible for serving as a bridge between the left and the right halves of the cerebellum. It also facilitates communication between the cerebrum, the cerebellum, and the medulla oblongata. The twin lobe structure behind the brain stem is the cerebellum. It is responsible for coordinating movement. It does this by receiving nerve impulses from all over the body, such as the balance and equilibrium centers in your inner ear, and adjusts and fine-tunes these actions by passing the regulating signals to the motor neurons of the brain and spinal cord. The hypothalamus is a small but important neuron cluster at the base of the brain. This organ is responsible for many body functions, such as sleep and wakefulness, sexual urges, thirst, and hunger. It also controls endocrine activity by regulating the work of the pituitary gland and plays an important role in the emotions of pain and pleasure. The pituitary gland is a small, pea-sized gland attached to the hypothalamus. This gland secretes hormones which regulate other endocrine glands, controlling growth, reproduction, and numerous metabolic processes. The cerebrum is the largest portion of the brain and is the seat of reason and creativity. It is descriptively divided into four sections or lobes, the frontal lobe, the occipital lobe, the parietal lobe, and the temporal lobe. The occipital lobe is the lower portion of the cerebrum, located near the occipital bone of the skull. It contains the centers responsible for sight. The parietal lobe is located in the upper middle part of the brain. It is the receiving area for touch sensations and information about spatial orientation. The temporal lobe is located near the temples of the skull. It contains the centers for hearing, smell, and memory. The frontal lobe is the front portion of the cerebrum, located just behind your forehead. It is responsible for voluntary motor coordination. It houses control centers for muscular control of the body and for coordinated rhythmical movements of the head and throat, such as chewing, licking, and swallowing. The frontal lobe also contains the higher thought processing centers of memory, reasoning, and associative conceptualizing. Some researchers also theorize that the essence of personality is located here.